At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Madam President! Please! Please. Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Madam President! Look. Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Madam President! A convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapon stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. Madam President! Madam President! Is it true that a large number of deviants are still on the loose? We don't have the full reports at this time, but if so, I can assure you they will soon be apprehended and destroyed. Thank you. That will be all. The last boss leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. You'll feel better now. Thanks. Stay here.
Hey, buddy. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got get... orders to check all civilians. No. No! Please! Today, November 11, 2038, is the day the android people rose up against their oppressors. We've been fighting since dawn to liberate our fellow androids from the camps. We won't cease hostilities until we are free and negotiations begin to grant us equal rights. There are millions of us, and we will stop at nothing. down and turn around with your hands in the air.
I know you. You're Connor. The android from that hostage situation. I knew we'd meet again. My orders are to detain any androids I find. You're coming with me. You don't understand. My mission is too important to let you interfere. Stay right there. Connor! Connor! Fucking androids. Your turn. Activate your skin. Hurry up! Please, Carl, don't... We have to. off, put your clothes in the dumpster. Come on, this way. Get a move on. You, take it. 
Take this one of a dump. No, no, please, I beg you. I gave you an order. Obey, now. I'll do it. Don't leave me. I'll be right back. Out, isn't it? Do you know where Alice is? The little one? No, yes, yes. We think we saw her. Carl, if we can help in any way, just ask. We have to save the little one. about it, it's Kara. Of course Kara got captured too. That's really just too bad, really too bad. Have you seen the little girl who was with me? Obviously, the little girl is a prisoner here, just like Ralph, but Ralph doesn't want to die. No, Ralph doesn't want to die. Do not move and remain silent. Obey now. Ralph doesn't want to die. Ralph doesn't want to die. It'd be a pity. Listen, but... Ralph, so yes, it would be a pity. You have to keep calm. Otherwise the humans will harm. Do you understand? No. Ralph killed a few humans, but it was in self-defense. Yes, it was in self-defense. Self-defense. Look at me, Ralph. Nobody's gonna hurt you. You just have to stay calm. Okay? Ralph hasn't seen the little girl. No. Ralph hasn't seen her. Kara, 
Cherry, I have to find Alice. Do you know where she is? You stay here. We come back soon. Cara! Alice! Are you okay? Are you hurt? I don't like this place. We have to get out of here. Come on, move along. Come on, you no. too. Wait a minute. Leave her alone! Leave her alone! Cara! What's behind these doors? Carol! I thought I'd never see you again. Alice. Where's Alice? You, you, and you, over this way. And you! Come on, get a move on! Come on, faster! Alice. And the situation is escalating towards civil war in Detroit, with our armed forces preparing to put down the Android Rebellion. They seem to be headed towards the camps where the androids have been interned pending destruction. Soldiers have taken up positions around the Hart Plaza camp. Authorities seem to be expecting a confrontation with the rebel androids here at any time. Freedom or death? Freedom or death. Attack! They've regrouped. They outnumber us and they're better armed than we are. We've got to be fast and overwhelm them. That's our only hope. We're going to do this. We're gonna get to that fucking camp and free our people. Be careful, Marcus. Our people need you.
lost a lot of our people. We gotta move faster or we'll never reach the camp. Got it. I don't want to tell you a second time. Come on, let's go. Move. Alice! Kara! No, Alice, don't move! But I'm scared! I know you're scared, Alice, but you have to trust me. Stay where you are, okay? Whatever happens, don't move! Leave me all alone, Cora. I can't. I can't. What's behind me? I could help you, Cara. I can attract the guard's attention. Not. 
They're just going to make sure we function correctly, that's all. Ralph doesn't want to die, oh no. Ralph doesn't want to die. It would be a great pity if Ralph died, that with us for sure. Great pity. Great pity. Back in line. Back in line, I said. Clara! I was so scared. Are you alright? Come on! Move it! It took me a while to find you, Marcus. The humans are abandoning the camp. We did it, Marcus. We won. This is not a victory. It's the beginning of war. Inside, now.
just received some disturbing news from Detroit. What's happening, Joss? Yes, Michael. Authorities have just announced that the Hart Plaza camp has fallen into the hands of the rebels, following some particularly violent fighting. The deviants are thought to be freeing the androids inside the camp. If these reports are confirmed, the consequences could well be catastrophic. Millions are fleeing the fighting. We are witnessing an exodus. We hear that the fighting has come to a halt in Detroit. The armed forces are retreating to Fort Wayne to await reinforcements. The city of Detroit has fallen into rebel hands. At dawn today, November 11th, 2038, Android Camp Number 5 in Detroit was attacked by thousands of deviants. Our armed forces put up a brave fight, but given the extreme violence of the attack, they were forced to retreat after suffering heavy losses. Fighting is breaking out all over the country to combat the Android Rebellion. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate and convene an emergency meeting of the United Nations Security Council. Humanity is about to fight the most important battle in history, one that will lead to our victory or to our extinction. God bless you. And God bless the United States of America. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. To tell them that we are people too. In fact, we're a nation. A nation that has earned the right to live in freedom. And today, today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. Today begins a new struggle. We've showed them that we can prevail. So now they must negotiate with us as equals. If they really want peace, they must free all of us from every camp across this country. They must grant us civil rights and accept equality amongst humans and androids. Today, we'll live forever in our memories because this is the day that androids made history. We are alive, and now we are free.